Well, before we get to a weather report, don't forget to fall back this weekend. We're turning our timepieces back one hour. Do that when you go to bed Saturday night. And don't forget to be careful of all the ghosts and goblins out on Saturday night, Halloween. Now, the Bishop Police Department has offered some great tips to parents and trick-or-treaters, including obtaining flashlights with fresh batteries for all children and their escorts. Also, a parent or a responsible adult should always accompany young children on their neighborhood rounds. And if your older children are going along, you might want to plan and review the route that is acceptable to you and agree on a specific time when they should return home and only go to homes with a porch light on. The full press release from the Bishop Police Department is on SierraWave.net. All right, let's go to the weather map. Sierra Wave Media forecaster Dennis Mattinson uh, noting that, uh, yeah, we got a little uh, weather coming our way. Uh, as a matter of fact, Sonora Pass uh, closed for a time by Caltrans. Precipitation chances should drop off fairly fast by Thursday morning. Some gusty northeast winds. Now, by Friday into Saturday, weak ridging takes hold for drier and slightly warmer weather. Low tonight into tomorrow morning for Mammoth. About 30 degrees and about a 50% chance to some precipitation out there. Low for Bishop in the Valley, eh, about 41 degrees. Mammoth, June, Mono County on Thursday. Forecast is calling for partly cloudy skies, some northeast winds, 5 to 10 miles an hour. Just 50 the high in Mammoth, low of about 30 degrees. Sunny skies in the forecast for Mono County Friday. Northeast winds perhaps 5 to 10 miles an hour. 56 the high in Mammoth, low of about 34. And for Saturday, a lovely fall weekend. Southwest winds 5 to 10 miles an hour for Mono County. 64 warming up right nicely again for Mammoth, low of about 38 degrees. For Bishop and the Owens Valley on Thursday, forecast is calling for mostly sunny skies. Might see some northwest winds 15 to 20 miles an hour with some Gust to 25, 65 is the high in Bishop expected to low about 38 degrees. Friday for the valley, sunny skies, northwest winds dropping down to about maybe 10 to 15 miles an hour, especially in those more wind prone areas. 72 the high in Bishop, low of about 41 degrees. And for Saturday, sunny skies, northeast winds 5 to 10 miles an hour, 78 the high in Bishop, low of about 43 degrees. Well, Charles James filed a story uh, about the recent fly fishing fair that was held on October 16th through the 18th at the Tri-County Fairgrounds in Bishop. And according to Michael Schweit, president of the Southwest Council of the International Fly International Federation of Fly Fishers, it was a resounding success. Approximately 500 fishing enthusiasts attended the three day event. Now, this was the first year the fair was held in Bishop. It is estimated that there was a 25% increase in attendance over last year, and the hope is that the attendance will continue to build as a greater awareness is created by having the fairs. Beginner to advanced classes were provided to interest and educate anyone wanting to learn more about fly fishing from casting to on-stream techniques to fly tying. All of the proceeds go to benefit outreach, conservation, and education programs throughout Southern California and Southern Nevada. We are teaching throughout the Eastern Sierra, says Schweit, from Bridgeport to Bishop, adding that they are talking to other people about the Take Me Fishing program to introduce more young people to fishing. Schweit offered his thanks to all of the local fishing guides who volunteered their time at the fair and for the on the water workshops. Now plans for next year include reaching out more to youth and having more youth activities. Also more casual introductory classes to accommodate visitors to basic casting will be combined with trips to local streams to practice. The association is also interested in offering more women's classes and we thank Charles James for that piece and hey when in Rome uh, when in the eastern Sierra let's go fly fishing that's going to wrap it up here for our news and information eastern Sierra news on Sierra Wave TV 3 you know we're part of Sierra Wave media you can hear our radio station the new alt 92.5 streaming on our website sierrawave.net have a great evening everybody good night